All right, ladies and gents, we're back. More FF16. We need to get 500 points to learn Heat Wave upgraded. Now we're in Isla, <clears throat> in Walud territory. What do you think, Clive? Then we're too late. I'll bring my chat back up. There we go. You think all the villages in Ash are like this? A question for later, Cap. Yet again. Here they come. And come and come and come. Okay, one of them's war crying, one of them is casting cure. Two of them are casting cure, so we're gonna do this. This is what we get from one or both of the healers. Both of the healers are dead. I'm sure you'll be fine. Damage here, but should be enough. He's dead. Alright, we got another group here coming in shortly, probably. I don't know why this guy didn't just come out immediately because I feel like Dick Kashik should know. Maybe he had to get his armor on. Look at that axe, though. Victor, are you attracted to Dolph Lundgren? Shit. 
That was bad on my part. get judgment bolt back. I think I will. Just in time to finish him off. Boom. What was that sound? Almost enough to uh up my next ability to look at that. Tell me there's more of the bastards. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you could say that. Have you come to watch, Odin? <laughs> Bound for stone here. Good. My master awaits you in the capital, though I cannot allow you to attend him in your present state. And how are you going to stop us? Why, with this! Gun gears. What did you do? Would you mind telling me what the fuck just happened? Ah, birds. Oh, you've got to be. How are we supposed to get through that? We seek an audience with the king. If His Majesty wants me to come and ask him, then that is exactly what I'll do. Before you go practicing your petition, we don't even know where the fucker went. 
How about we cool our heads and think this through, eh? Alright. Alright. Maybe there's something here we can use. Maybe there is. I think there's something in this building over here we can pick up. Oh, a lot of treasure to be had here, I don't recall, but I think there's something in here. Anyone here? Look at all this food just left on the table. All these rats. in Valisea. No matter the season, twin side streets bustle from dawn to dusk with visitors from across the realm. Its inns and boarding houses overflow with merchants, seafarers, travelers, and tradespeople of all stripes. And where such sorts gather the ale and ale is in no such pie, rumor and hearsay are soon doled out with equal abandon. Twas from a ruddy-faced midshipman that I first heard of the tale of the Shimmering Isle that was said to emerge occasionally from the mist along a certain well-sailed shipping route. No man had ever seen it more than once, giving rise to the rumors that it was no more than an apparition. An ill omen one at that. They say them that sees it twice never makes it home to tell the tale, growled the midshipman, his fair eyes glistening with morbid relish. Okay. Here. Okay. Look, everybody just like fucking vanished overnight. There it is. All right, that gave me an amber, so. I'm pretty sure amber has some uses. It's not super duper useful, but. I was right that there was a treasure chest in there. And then there's also. I don't think it's gonna be here yet, but later there's something up here. We can check though. No harm in that. Yeah, he's not here, there but there's a treasure chest. Home, Clive. Then let's find somewhere to sit down and look at the map. Hey, an orchestrian role. Okay, so that was good. At least that was useful. In some fashion. But yeah, I like I, I like Gab, he's a good character. Can't go in there. So we got them all. So did I. Vector, do you get upset when people try to see you in your small clothes? Funny bloody hides. Oh look, a house. get upset when people try to see you in your small clothes? Asking, but but 
went on here? Shit, her name's Etta. It all started when the skies changed. The elders said it was the Ark. One by one, people went mad. Minds taken by the ether. Till only I remained. By then, I was too far alone to run. And, and then the nights came. And I didn't know what to do. Grandparents told us when we misbehaved about how the heavens would grow dark before the lamp took her last breath. The end of the world. You said the others went mad, but where did they go? They. They all left. East to the tower to Reverie. The elders, the healer, the blacksmith, my husband. You're thinking he did this? Of course. Who else could it be? You were in Kamba. You saw what he did to the people. Then what about her? How come her nut hasn't cracked? The baby, perhaps? Could be protecting her from the ether. I can't think of any other explanation. You mean... it's a bearer? It won't matter what it is once Ultima's magic takes hold. Time's running out. This tower, that's where we'll find the king. Why don't they use the Arche to threaten their grandkids when they're, when they're bad? You keep doing bad stuff, I'll mean, usher in the Arche. It's the same as Phoenix Gate. Which means at the end of these stairs should be... Don't keep uh, if you don't stop being bad, I'll usher in the end of the world. <laughs> Why is there a blood pool just at the door? The mural. and his vessel be free. Garuda, Ramu, Shiva, Titan, Bahamut, Odin. Even Leviathan the Lost is here. But where is the fiend? the founder <laughs> 
So that's what you want, isn't it, Ultima? We've dealt with... We know who the Phoenix is, obviously. We know who Garuda was, Ramu, Titan, Shiva, Odin. So that's how it's gonna Ahmet. be, then. I'm not asking, Gav. I need you to stay with Edda. What? I must do this alone. If I don't return, you're to find Joshua and make for the Enterprise. Understood? Oh. I... Just don't you go dying on me. Sid's name suits your miserable mug better than mine. Don't worry. I haven't finished with it yet. So, story-wise, Leviathan hasn't been heard from in years. So that's why he's if referred Barnabas to as... controlling the Akashic, then wherever he goes, they'll follow. And so will I. Anyway, that's why he's referred to as the Lost, because uh, Leviathan himself and his dominant have not been seen for X amount of years. I don't remember exactly how much. <laughs> We got about eight minutes left so we can make our way down to the tower before we're done for today. Dead. Good thing we brought Ambrosia with us and she can she can get inside this giant portal. I don't do well that is uh... Did Torgo kill that one all on his own? Good job, Torgo. Oh, we have over 500 now, hang on. Next one we're going to learn is these guys. Here's a dead end. This will be a side quest area later on. Not much we can do in there right now, but we will we'll head there eventually. Over here, however, is the site of a boss fight, I think. Even if I miss, I'm pretty adept at making it uh, turn into a more of a victory. Okay, no, this isn't where it is. There's a there's a hunt we're gonna get later on that unfortunately is quite familiar at this point uh, in this area. But right now, there's just this fucker. Too slow.
may not actually survive this. Nope. That onslaught proved to be too much for it. Okay. Unfortunately, the game gives you a cutscene, but there's actually a. Hang on, let's go over here. There's a church chest there. One of the ones that looks like it might have something useful. Adamantite gauntlets, there we go! It's one of the few ones in the game that actually gives you something worthwhile. These, unlike most wrist wear, which admittedly only protects one's wrist, gauntlets cover both lower arm and hand. Any drop in mobility is made up for by an increased threshold to pain. Uh, increases maximum HP by 500. Anyway, uh, there's an achievement to activate all of the uh, obelisks in the game, uh, these things here. Now there is one down here, but if, as you get close to this, it gives you a cutscene. Oh, it, did, it activates it now, okay. It didn't used to, so I had to go back here and get this one because it didn't, uh, it didn't give me credit for it. At least they finally realized that. <laughs> Made me run all the way fuck back down here. I was like scouring the map trying to figure out exactly where the it, fuck I had to go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for today's stream. We got quite a bit done uh, overall, even though it wasn't all main story. We got a lot of the side quests done, which is great because, yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure we're done with uh, Bachled entirely now. I think we're done with Javaz. Um, we're not done with Northreach. There's definitely some more to do there. I think we're done with Eastpool. Martha's Rest might have one or two more things left to do. But uh, yeah, we, we finished off a good many of the storylines. So, uh, for tomorrow, we're going to continue on with this main story into Reverie, a single stolid spire rising high above the Deadlands to pierce the very heavens. The final boss of this is probably one of the two bosses I had the most trouble with in the base game. So, yay. Either way, guys, thank you very much for viewing.